hey lovelies welcome back to the channel so if you are new here my name is Bridget and on this channel I do a lot of DIY natural um, hair care videos you know show you all how to grow your hair using your own uh, ingredients in your kitchen and I also do a lot of protective hairstyle videos for kids so consider subscribing if you are not yet subscribed to this channel and you're gonna be loving it here so guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you all this super amazing product guys this product or this ingredient has been scientifically proven to grow hair longer thicker healthier and all those good stuff and you can also consume this product like internally so i'm going to be showing you all how to use this amazing product or this ingredient to grow your hair super long you know healthier thicker stronger and all those good stuff so guys i'm going to be showing you all how to make your own um avocado butter at home so the ingredient you're gonna be needing is some avocados like this is the first ingredient i'm going to be using these avocados and these ones are a little bit um i can say they are like spoiled or they are soft I kept them in the refrigerator I, they are not really spoiled but they are like soft and they change color a little bit so i'm just going to scoop out the parts which are i think are good for the diy so if you have like a uh, really good avocados you can use just one but if your avocados are bad like mine you can just go ahead to use two of them because you really want to if you really want to make sure that you have avocado in uh, a reasonable quantity And I'm going to be using some olive oil. You can use coconut oil, almond oil, um, jojoba oil, any oil of your choice. But I decided to use olive oil because this is the one I have uh, at home at the moment. And avocado is a great source of biotin. And adding this B complex back into your diet may also help to grow your hair healthier. And guys, like I said, you can also use avocado. You can eat it you can use it for your diy you can make your oil you can make butter you know you can make many things with avocado and a study in 2015 you know found out that you know the minerals in avocado or avocado oils including potassium and magnesium may seal critical cells which can help your hair to look smooth and shiny and also prevent it from breakage the number one problem we all face with our hair is breakage like every one of us our hair goes but if you cannot retain the length it means you have been experiencing breakage or your hair has been breaking over time so um normally our hair goes half an inch a month so by the by one year you have to um have like six inches of hair on your head so all these diys i make it is not a magic potion it is just there to help your hair to you know to retain that length you know some people come and ask me how they can grow their hair guys our hair grows um you know half an inch a month so all these diy products and all these ingredients i make on this channel is just to help us to retain that length which we have grown or to retain the hair which we have grown so what i did was as you can see i cooked my avocado oil in a very low heat you know the double using the double boiler method and i make sure that all the all the benefits of the avocado goes into the oil because that is what we are going to be needing you can also use avocado oil if you have that at home but i do not have avocado oil at home and i think avocado oil is a little bit expensive in my in my opinion and especially where i live so everything has gone into the oil this is just the chaff left you know the avocado chaff and this is what the oil looks like it is so so rich it is i just love it guys so i'm just going to go into you know preparing the butter like i said today we are doing avocado butter and this one is from chad this butter is from chad i used to sell this butter but it has gone out of stock so i'll be restocking you know in the future so i just put a little bit of uh, butter just put whichever quantity you want for your butter
pair of jeans, a shirt or two. We didn't pack as if we weren't going back. It doesn't matter if it's true. I've got a feeling love will give us what we like. The world is waiting up. The world is waiting half a step beyond our door. And if it's not enough, I want to see the stuff the world has got in store. Uh, I want to take it all in, I'm falling. The cityscape by night, want to catch in my photos. Where you go, every corner twice as bright. There'll be my treasures forever. When I can hold you tight, I'll see the Stockholm lights. The Stockholm lights, the Stockholm lights. a year away like the seconds the beginning and the end uh, but if in time it's yesterday your picture's gonna bring it home to me again the world is waiting up the world is waiting half a step beyond our door oh, and if it's not enough so after i'm done with skin the shea butter i'll just go ahead to add the avocado oil like i did not have like so much avocado oil and my olive oil got finished you know in this process so i'll just go ahead to add another oil just to get that consistency i'm going in for if you do not want your butter to be like really really fluffy then you can just stop at this point you know but if you really want your butter to be like fluffy just go ahead to add more oil depending on the consistency you are going in for so i'll be adding a uh, moringa oil which is the only oil i have at home i have not stocked i have not stocked uh, my products you know my diy products so this is the oil i have at home and of course you can also add a moringa oil you can add as many oils as you want you know in into your butter but since i said i'm i'm doing like avocado oil avocado butter i just wanted to stick with um like the avocado oil so yeah just go ahead to add any oil of your choice depending on your preference but if you can get as much avocado oil in the process then you are good to go so this is what it looks like i just love my butters to be really really fluffy because i realized that after like one two three four days the butter becomes a little bit hard you know because i have low porosity i just want many of my products to be like super light so they can penetrate into my hair strands and keep my hair all moisturized throughout the week like if you use this product they can keep your hair like uh, moisturized for one or two weeks guys trust me on this especially if you sleep with a satin hair bonnet and one other trick you can do is to cover your hair with a plastic cap like the small light plastic or shower caps and then you cover your hair with a hair, hair bonnet and you sleep at night the next morning your hair is going to be like super moisturized the shower cap must have produced a lot of heat which you in, uh, increase blood flow on your scalp and also um increase or make you the sebum on your hair to just run down your hair strand and it's going to keep your hair moisturized so this is what it looks like i'm just going to show you all how i apply this on my daughter and we use any diy product i make make on this channel i use it on my girls and i i'm digging through the glove box i thought i had a map in here the driver's door doesn't lock I bought the car my junior year. There's candy in my backpack. And this is my daughter. Her hair was washed and conditioned, washed and deep conditioned. So I'm just going to apply leave-in conditioner and I'm going to show you all what I do. I normally stretch my daughter's hair and even my hair. I normally stretch our hair because I realize when the hair is really kinky, it breaks a lot. So if you have problem of retaining leave, try as much as possible to keep your hair super stretched, either using the blow dry uh blow dryer or you can use uh african treading method this blow dry brush i got it from my local beauty supply store but you can also get it from revlon i think revlon beauty has uh, the, the exact 
blow dryer even though it is really expensive with revlon but this one i got from my local beauty supply store here in sweden a lot, a lot of people have asked me where i got this blow dryer so you can check revlon hair straightening brush on amazon or in your local beauty supply store or just go to google and google it so yeah so that this is what i just normally do and after this i apply the butter which will keep a hair super moisturized for like one or two weeks like guys trust me on this when your hair is stretched your hair is going to be moisturized more moisturized than when it is left in the kinkiest form which prevents sebum from running down you know from your scalp all the way down to your hair strands because when your hair is kinky it just makes the sebum to just stay on your scalp so because sebum is really really important sebum is a natural oils on your scalp so that is why we the natural ladies we experience a lot of shedding um, a lot of dryness because the sebum cannot run through your hair strand so when your hair is stretched um, it allows sebum, the natural sebum from your scalp to just run through your hair strands, keeping it moisturized, you know, plus the, the butter and the oil you apply on your strand. So it's really going to keep your hair super moisturized all to the day. So thank you all for watching and see you in my next video. Have a blessed day. Bye. We're on the way to New York City. Take my hand and see. Manhattan never looks so pretty.